Hi, I'm Kimber Westfall with DallasNews.com and we're at the Windspear Opera House and we are interviewing two performers from Cirque Dreams Jungle Fantasy today. We have Billy Jackson and Eddie Asinich. They are our jungle boys of the performance. Um, tell us how you guys got into, into this uh, type of performance. Well, I was a performer growing up and I auditioned just like you, uh, any other singer or dancer would and uh, we're lucky enough now to be here with Cirque Dreams Jungle Fantasy and uh, it's just a great time. You see so many things you never thought could happen, people flying through the air up to 30 feet in the air in these amazing costumes, so it's just a lot of fun for the whole family. I can only imagine the stories that you tell. <laughs> so how does it feel spinning all day, all day through practice and performances, you know, flying through the air? Uh, I mean, it's great. We're doing really difficult things. People have trained their whole lives for this. So, um, like, I, like, it's just a lot of fun. I'm amazed at what people are doing, and uh, they're just as impressed by, you know, things that anyone else is doing on stage. So we all have uh, respect for each other, which is really great to work with. And Eddie, what's your favorite thing about being involved with the show? Yeah, I was just going to say, like, the show, every time I see it, it still scares me, like, to see these amazing acts. Like, I never get used to it. So I can only imagine how the audience will feel when they see it for the first time. It's going to be incredible. And have you ever had any injuries? I mean, I'm sure with all of these feats that you're accomplishing that it's, it could be a little bit dangerous at times. Um, not yet. So I'm going to knock on wood right now. Yeah. <laughs> but no, never any injuries. We we stretch before we warm up. So we've been lucky. Yeah. Well, I'm so glad to hear that. Um, so what can folks expect when attending the show? Uh, you can expect amazing costumes like we're wearing here. These are all made in the Cir uh, Cirque Dream Studio in Fort Lauderdale um, by Nora, our, our wardrobe in the wardrobe department. And uh, you're going to see original music uh, sung uh, by our lovely Mother Nature, who was at the singer who was on Broadway with the show. And uh, like we said, amazing acrobatic feats. You're going to see jungles coming to life our jungle animals coming to life and doing amazing acrobatic skills and things you've never even thought you would see and then they go past what you thought you would never see so it's just an amazing show. And Eddie, when can folks in Dallas catch the show? We're doing five performances here June 19th to the 21st and Friday June 19th at 7.30 p.m. Saturday and Sunday 2 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. All right, sounds like there's plenty of options to come and catch the show. And is this a family-friendly show for all folks to enjoy? It is a family-friendly show. You, like I said, you're going to see all these colorful costumes, and there's always something to watch on stage to keep everyone's attention going the whole time. There's great music, and like I said, it's things you've never thought of in your life, and they're happening right in front of you. And we're amazed every time we see it, and we think the audiences are going to be amazed. And like, uh, tickets are still available, so if you're looking for something to do on Father's Day, come on down to the AT&T Performing Arts Center right here in Dallas, and we'll give you a good show. Okay, well, thank you so much for taking the time from your practice and, yeah. and uh, speaking with me, and break a leg. All right, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> this is Kimber Westfall, DallasNews.com.